2021, second summer of the pandemic. In response to canceled shows everywhere, many musicians would look for alternative ways to create and perform their music. In the southern suburbs of Stockholm, Sweden, guitarist Steiner Adnikvam made a decision to go off-grid mobile and invite his friends to the party. This is Suburban Encounters. Hi, and welcome to the sixth show out of eight in this online concert series. My name is Steiner. In today's episode, we're going to meet with Denise Fontura. Denise Fontura is a Brazilian singer and songwriter, originally from Porto Alegre, who first found success in Rio de Janeiro with the all-female hip-hop group Anastasias, and later went on to perform with several celebrated Brazilian artists. Since 2008, she lives in Estonia, and over the past decade, she has made a name for herself as one of the finest exponents of Brazilian music in the Baltics. It was my honor to receive her in Norsborg, South Stockholm, for a musical meeting one-on-one. -on -one. This is our suburban encounter. <laughs> Ainda restou um talvez A nossa frase tá sem ponto final Alguma coisa por dizer E admitir que sentir falta Às vezes é normal Portanto tem um porém A nossa música tempos terminou Fico sem graça pra dançar Mais uma vez e me perder No teu laia laia vai doer O que já curou Há tanto tempo, meu bem São memórias pra lembrar Ilusões pra reencontrar Ai, não tem jeito, não, 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 não Ponto de interrogação Onde eu entrego as chaves desse salão Todos os cacos eu juntei Não há mais pranto pra chorar Me deixe em paz agora Pois é pra frente que se anda, baby Não tenha medo do futuro, não Que tá lá atrás virou história é. Nossa frase tá sem ponto final Alguma coisa por dizer E admitir que sentir falta Às vezes é normal Portanto tem um porém A nossa música há tempos terminou Fico sem graça pra dançar mais uma vez e me perder No teu laia laia vai doer 
corpo que já curou Há tanto tempo, meu bem São memórias pra lembrar Ilusões pra reencontrar Ai, não tem jeito, não, 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 não Ponto de interrogação Onde eu entrego as chaves desse salão Todos os cacos eu juntei Não há mais pranto pra chorar E deixe em paz agora Pois é pra frente que se anda, baby Não tenha medo do futuro, não Que tá lá atrás virou história Mais uma letra, mais uma canção Não tenha medo do futuro, baby Pois é pra frente que se anda Mais uma letra, mais uma história Que tá lá atrás, just let it go Saudade Pra um coração Daquele cotidiano Daquela confusão Esperando a visita Chegar no portão Prende o cachorro guria Corre, vai, compra pão Tira a água do fogo Serva o chimarrão Liga pro tio Cacá E o Juque e a Conceição Olha lá que pequeno, tá de pé no chão Vamos sentar lá fora, desliga essa televisão Ai, 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 uou Ai, 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 oh, ai, 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 Sábado, arrumação Era todo mundo na luta Cada um com a sua função Colocava o vinil pra tocar Pra poeira subir com a música Com a música Descendo conversa Contando piada A lenga lenga começava Pra não se fazer mais nada Dia uma história, recordação de um tempo que não volta não. Olha o trem, da saudade passando. 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 Saudade pra um coração Daquele cotidiano Daquela confusão Esperando a visita Chegar no portão Prende o cachorro guria Corre, vai, compra pão Tira a água do fogo Serve o chimarrão Liga pro tio Cacaio Juque a Conceição Olha lá que pequeno tá de pé no chão Vamos sentar lá fora, desliga essa televisão
Hi, I hope you're enjoying the show. If you want to support this, you can buy anything you like in the web shop at musicmakesyouhappy.com. Using the code SUBURBAN will give you a 10% discount off your order. Thank you. Sertão, cabra macho, não ajoelha Nem faz parelha com quem é de traição Puxa o facão, risca o chão que sai sem telha Que tem vez que só mesmo a lei do cão É lamp, é lamp, é lamp, é lampião Meu candeeiro encantado Meu candeeiro encantado Meu candeeiro Enquanto a faca não sai toda vermelha A cabroeira não dá sossego não E vira bustre pra cor no corte orelha E nem já fez virgulinho no capitão É lamp, é lamp, é lamp, é lampião meu candeeiro encantado, meu candeeiro encantado, meu candeeiro encantado. Já foi-se o tempo do fuzil papá amarelo pra se bater com o poder lá no sertão. Mas Lampião disse que contra o flagelo tem que lutar com Seu candeeiro Faltam chegar mais Gonzagas Lá de Exu Falta o Brasil de Jackson do Pandeiro Maco, Lelê Carimbó e Maracatu É não, é não, é não, Meu candeeiro encantado Meu candeeiro encantado Meu candeeiro encantado Sol, as asas no ar E o belo canto que me trouxe até você Perder os sentidos, perder-me no teu riso Falar de tudo e nada, até ter nada pra dizer Apenas ser Grande era a lua, no profundo azul Do alto a olhar Bela testemunha dos encontros do amor Acompanha desejos Regente de destinos e enredos E 
Tem momentos em que os anjos descem pra cantar Mas ai que dura a paixão Choros, risos sem razão E assim tudo chega ao seu fim Mas vou lembrar de tudo aquilo que passou Vou tirar de dentro do meu peito Uma história que seguiu por caminhos diferentes E agora eu canto essa canção para você De um amor que foi com o tempo Acabou-se em lamento Já é hora e desejo coisas boas pra você Até a gente se ver Talvez virar um pouquinho só. Uhum. Tá, então tá. Ai. <laughs> All right, Denise. All right, I'm so, Stephen. I'm, I'm so glad that, you, that you're here. <laughs> Me that too. You came. Me too. We had the chance to do this. It was just a wonderful experience to yes. work with you, to play with you, and just exactly. to the same. Hang out and just yeah, have fun. Yeah. Make music. Yes. That's true. And. Um, Yeah, and you brought some beautiful songs. Okay, you also presented me to. Yeah, know, we like were. You, very, yeah. We were together, and it was the first time actually I was able to, you know, to somehow create or, uh, you know, in, mm -hmm. um, to, in collaboration. Like, to collaborate, yeah. yeah. I mean, to like not, because for me it's usually like a very individual process. Like when I'm when I'm writing down, you know, lyrics and mm -hmm. everything. I always do by myself, but it was nice that we could actually collaborate. I was not shy at the end, you know, and, mm -hmm. and that's a pretty nice thing to learn, you know, to collaborate and be open to that. I have to say for me too, it's like, uh, yeah. it's, you know, it's not, normally I would, you know, mm -hmm. compose alone and, you know, it's yeah. like, I, I under, totally understand that, mm -hmm, you know, mm -hmm. and, uh, but it just, well, it just, you know, it just felt very natural to work exactly. with you. Exactly. For the viewers to understand what we're actually talking about, <laughs> yeah. I, I, I sent you this. We were discussing songs, right? Yes. And I sent you this, uh, this theme, this, this. Yeah. And I was like, this thing needs a, uh, a lyric. Yeah, that you know, it already had a lyric, but well, kind like of an a, idea, like yeah, idea, like an old yeah, idea, the main idea. Yeah. And then I. And you just interpreted that. Yeah, developed. Yeah. Okay, thank you. No, I, really, I appreciate I, yeah. <laughs> that. Yeah. yeah, it was really nice. Very challenging to work as well. Uh, I would say a difficult song, not easy one. But uh, but it was. I'm I'm very glad and happy with the result. I hope you're. Too. Oh yeah, I'm I'm just. <laughs> yeah. Super. Yeah. I'm a long time fan of, of uh, Lenini, for example. Okay. Yeah. Uh, but I've never actually played any music of him. Oh but really? I was very thrilled that we that you. Uh, brought this song. Yeah, no, I've been uh, actually I've been performing some of Lenini's songs 
in Estonia with the with the you know with the band that I used to perform quite a lot for many years. And uh, yeah, we I think we all like Lenini a lot, so we we did few of his songs. You know, he's like one of the the greatest you know yeah, contemporary the, artists, yeah, and one of the composers. Voices, yeah, yeah, very strong and and meaningful work. I think yeah. in Brazilian music. So yeah, why not to bring. Lenin. I mean, the only co cover we were, we were doing, I think that was a, I think it was a good one. I, yeah, I it like was the, a perfect choice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you said something there. You said in Estonia, because you live in Estonia, right? I do live in Estonia for uh -huh. 13 years now. In Tallinn. It's in Tallinn, yeah, uh -huh. the capital, for many many years. Yeah. Wow, that's that's. Uh... <laughs> It's fantastic. How do you how do you like it? I do like it. Of course, it's a it's a big uh, change, you know. Mm -hmm. uh, even though I'm coming from from south of Brazil, which is like a you know the coldest region, and so I'm kind of used to the to cold, you know, mm -hmm. to the cold weather. But uh, in Estonia, we have you know it's a lot more extreme, but it's quite similar also to to here, I guess, to Sweden. So sure. you know, it's sure. the you know, the darkness, I think, I would say it is the most difficult thing to me still, like in 13 years. Uh, because the cold, you know, you just put, a, you know, clothes on and, okay, you're fine. But just to not be able to see the sun, you know, D vitamin and everything. So it's kind of, uh, it, it has been affecting my mood, I would say. But uh, other than that, I think it's like pretty comfortable uh, place to leave to raise a child because I have a daughter. So it's like a very... Um, good and safe uh, environment, you know, to, to, to raise a child and things work pretty well, you know, like almost no bureaucracy at all. You know, it's like very uh, tech savvy, savvy country, you know, okay, things yeah. work well, a lot savvy, yeah. yeah, online and you have a lot of the public services online. So there's a lot of good things, you know, and I'm also able to, you know, do my music, you know, people respect that, you know, people like Brazilian music. They have this uh, uh, curiosity, I think, still. You know, like many of those countries, you know, that were under Soviet Union, where people couldn't really travel, uh, you know, for many, many years. So it's, it's still something new. Maybe for Swedish people, it's not as new, you know, but for them, I think it's, it's still something that they are discovering in general. Yeah. Like Brazilian music, the Latin American, uh, you know, music and everything. Mm -hmm. So I think it's good to be there and make part of the society that is still changing quite fast, I would say. Really? Wow. Yes, yeah. yes. You know, they are independent for, like, you know, since the end of 90s, so it's quite, you know. Yeah, sure. Things. It's still present. It's still, still present. Pres so, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's still, there's a lot of things happening. I think it's, uh, it's a good place to be. Mm -hmm. I like. And you've been working, like, Super much like playing all over. Mostly, yeah. Most of my uh, of the years that I've, I mean, I went to Estonia. I was invited to perform to yeah, do yeah. Brazilian music to sing Brazilian music, and uh, you know it really worked out. It was something that uh, I didn't have anything like uh, how to say guaranteed, like a you know like a job or whatever. Just you know there was this idea you know of like going to Estonia. You know uh, I was invited by a. a a musician who used to live in Brazil, so we know right each other since Brazil, okay. and he's uh, he has his roots in Estonia, right? His father was a Estonian, man. and uh, so he was uh, actually invited to perform like Brazilian music, bossa nova, and MPB, voice and guitar. So he was getting a lot of gigs, and he's not really a, a singer, you know. So he thought, okay, maybe I should bring, maybe I should invite someone who's you know, genuine, uh, a genuine, you know, authentic uh, <laughs> Brazilian yeah, singer, you yeah, know, yeah, and sure. then he, he, he wrote me, I think, or called, I don't remember now, and uh, saying that, hey, you know, I'm here in Estonia, and I was like, totally... Because yeah, you met him, and you were living in Rio de Janeiro, and you were yeah, we the already, in Rio? Yes, like, uh, yes. We didn't, we never actually managed to work together, to make music together. No, but you were working uh, independently with another yes. group. Yes, yeah, yeah, I had a hip hop group. Yeah, I had a hip hop group, and he wanted really to make something, a, a collaboration with that group. Mm -hmm. But then it didn't happen because, uh, you know, many, many things happened. Sure. Uh, life, you know, yeah. happened to us, and the, the group uh, was over. We quit. Uh, but I was the only one that kept going with the music. I was working at the time in a, in a studio, like recording and rehearsal studio mm -hmm. in Copacabana. 
So there I got introduced to, you know, a lot more, you know, different music and sounds and everything. And just being Rio de Janeiro, I was just exposed to so much more stuff that I wasn't in the south of Brazil, you know? Yeah, so what's the, Chorinho, what's the... um, I don't know, like samba, of course, uh, jongo, uh, I mean, wow, so yeah, much yeah. stuff. Rio is, de Janeiro. Is your city, what's the city you're from, actually? I'm from Porto Alegre. Porto Alegre. Porto Alegre, yeah. yes, the capital of Rio Grande do Sul. Yeah. And it's... Um, it's quite different, you know, like yeah. Porto Alegre, the, you know, the southern part of Brazil is not the, the tropical place that, you know, that we kind of sell mm -hmm. abroad, that everybody thinks that, you know, it's super uh, warm all over the country, but actually it's quite different. Mm -hmm. And I, in fact, in south of Brazil, we share much more culturally, I would say, with the, you know, Uruguay, Argentina, Paraguay, those countries yeah, around, yeah. you know, the, the, that region. We drink mate, which is like, you know, this herbal tea. So even the music is quite similar. We have, you know, the milonga, chamame. It's quite, you know, oh, yeah. we share much more with them, I would say, than with the rest of the country. And, uh, but I, when I went to Rio, when we were there, I just felt that, okay, that this was missing in my life, mm -hmm. you know? And then I learned a lot, I, you know, just being okay. in Rio. And it was a place to meet a lot of people you know, like from all over Brazil and also from, uh, from abroad, you know, even, you know, Jay, uh -huh. this guy, you yeah. know, the, the musician who invited me, he, he was living there. So it's a place of encounters and I don't know if, you know, to leave, it's a little bit, <laughs> you know, difficult. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Not, a, not an easy place to be, I think, uh, because everybody knows why. And, uh, but it's still like a very, you know, beautiful nature and, People, you know, like very friendly and open and so vibrant. Mm -hmm. So f for me, it was very good thing to be in Rio. It impacted my life, like yeah. as a person, and so not only the music. Yeah. yeah. And then I went to Rio, to, sorry, t from Rio to, to Tallinn, to Estonia, you know, invited to make Brazilian music. Just, okay, like where is Estonia? And I didn't know anything about <laughs> Yeah, there was, I don't think there was Google back then, or, uh, no, maybe, yeah, no, there was yeah. internet, but I was... No, I'm uh, doing an analog globe, like... Yeah, <laughs> yeah, and I was, like, just checking, you know, of course, he sent some pictures and some things, and I just felt, okay, that's a pretty cool place, why not, yeah. you know? It's a opportunity that, you know, it's a once-lifetime thing, so you know? since then, you've been playing all over Scandinavia, and the first time I met you, you was, we played together in Copenhagen. In Copenhagen. That was the first time I think we ago, yeah. played together, right? Yeah, it was yeah. the first time. But that was not so long ago. When was it? Two years, three years, two, three years ago. I think. Ago, right? Yeah, it, which was awesome, actually. It was a really yeah, nice experience. Yeah, was wonderful experience. Yes, exactly. Then, so, yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, I was just... Interview. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, um, anyway, so then, then um, well, we have this year behind us. Yeah. Uh, and uh, most people took a break. For, for in one way or another, yeah, anyway, things yeah. changed, right? Yes, 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 exactly, and, exactly. And I guess that's why, for me, that's why I kind of disinvolved this project, right? With, with Great. like these uh, kind of digital concerts. Yeah, or, yeah, yeah. And, awesome. And uh, and how's this year been for you? Like, also, well, it, it has been uh, pretty quiet, I would say, like music-wise, because you know we didn't have a lot uh, a lot of gigs anymore you know doing the you know all the restrictions that we had there and lockdowns in Estonia we had two lockdowns so okay, it was wow. quite yeah yeah exactly i know that in so Sweden you, you guys did well. it <laughs> yeah yeah no so it was, it was pretty difficult to you know to work with music mm -hmm. you know sure. and that, so i kind of like uh, i wouldn't i wouldn't say that i stopped with, with the music but i i i consider this time as a break as well for myself you know, I've been uh, putting more attention on, on my own music and developing, you know, my... Because I've seen you've been publishing a lot of, like, little things, uh, like creative stuff, like, yes. like online. Yes, like yes, exactly, yes. Short, uh, short bits. Like yeah, of, yeah, exactly. No, I... Brilliant. Okay, oh, yeah, I don't know if it's <laughs> brilliant, but okay, thanks. Yeah. So, yeah, so I'm kind of, like, uh, you know, exploring music in a different way, you know. I think, it's, I think it has been very important somehow this uh, this pause of course difficult you know like if you think about like the financial uh, sure. side but you know i have a regular job so it allows me also to keep going you know but not the other musicians so it has been it has been tough i would say in the sense for for musicians in general mm -hmm. but at the same time i feel uh 
it's kind of like a, a how to say a fresh air or kind of like a moment to breathe and really to think about music in a more profound way you know because I've been you know gigging a lot mm -hmm. and I feel that okay it's good to think about like my own identity what down, do I want just... what do do I really want with music you know because uh, you know, I have, I'm a creative being, you know, I started out in music with a hip hop group and also like mostly singing what I, uh, I was mm -hmm. writing, you know. And then when I came to Estonia, then I started to do a lot more like covers and, you know, uh, to sing the classics of Brazilian music, which I didn't actually do in Brazil. In Brazil, I was not really singing Brazilian music, I was doing you know, hip hop in Portuguese. Yeah, I was I, doing whatever the style, but in Portuguese. Actually, I think it's, it's interesting, mm -hmm. like on a side note, that, that when you actually come to Brazil, like the music that you mm -hmm. uh, uh, associate with, uh, you know, you come from Europe and you think of Brazilian music, and, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, like that music is kind of not really so present. Uh, not at all, especially like the Bossa Nova, yeah. for example, yeah. which like everyone, I mean, in Europe or I think US, I guess, uh, yeah, uh, you expect to, hear, to find yes. it, and it's not really, you know, it's, it's, it's yeah, not really there anymore. Exactly. You know, it's, it's moved, this, on, moved on. No, of course, there, there are still people doing, you know, Bossa Nova and all the Brazilian jazz. There are, you know, still, uh, you know, there are places where you can find this kind of music people are playing, but it's not the mainstream anymore. It's not something that, you know, the, the new generation, they don't even know who Stonja Bean is, you know? Yeah, sure. And even myself, when I was a lot younger, and stupid, <laughs> not stupid, but like a lot younger. I, I wouldn't say that I hated Bossa but I thought it was okay. It's so boring, and you know. Yeah, it's from another generation. Yeah, right? it's, exactly. It's and I, of course, I love, I love it, and I, I do appreciate, you know, the work that those guys did to sure. actually put Brazilian music in the, in the map, you know. Of course. And then, uh, but yeah, this is the thing. If you go to Brazil, it, it, yeah, you don't, you will not hear Tom Jobim or or João Gilberto, I mean, many others. But there's yeah, still not in, a, a vast richness of fantastic music. No, yes, yes, we, and, yes, and exactly, exactly. We shouldn't... positive, actually, that, that you move on, not just yes. recycle the same old, you know, yes. which is kind of... The there's strength. a lot of new stuff going. Yeah. I mean, the funk now is, like, the thing, you know? Sure. And uh, I like the rhythm, not the, the lyrics in general, but, uh, yeah, I mean, there's a lot of new things and, uh, you know... Brazilians are very creative, and I still, I yeah. think beer is still, you know, inventing, and, mm -hmm. and yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah, that's right. I agree. I couldn't agree more. Yeah. We were talking about, like, we were jumping to subjects, I think, no? Maybe. Did we finish the Estonian subject? Oh, well, I don't know. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah, I was going to say, uh, uh, maybe just uh, resuming or, or resumindo. Resumindo. Uh, like, because you told me that you're about to, like, this autumn, it's, it's, it looks like you're, you got, like, an EP coming out? Yeah, but, well, this is coming out, like, <laughs> it has, has been a long way, yeah. you know, like. And we played two of and, your original uh, songs. Yes. Maybe not from this EP, I'm not sure if they... Yeah, no, 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 not but, at all. The others are... Speaking of your music, we did yeah. play two of your songs. Yes. Um, yeah. What's the name of it? Uh, uh, Cabo Jam. Cabo Jam, yes, and the other one? And Sambique. the other one is... Uh, yeah, right? Sambique is kind of the nickname. Yeah. This, yeah, the, the, the real name would be... Uh, it is Tauves, maybe. Mm -hmm. Okay. But Sambique is like the... And it's kind of a strong message, right? It's about moving on. It's about moving being, on, uh, yes, yeah, like, exactly. Like always going forward, Yes, I would say. moving forward, totally, yeah. yeah, yeah. But I mean, it's kind of uh, almost biographic song. Yeah, sure. You know, and then, uh, yeah, yeah. But it's, you know, I think it's a positive I one. I think that's a beautiful message, like, you, like you know, it? don't get, you know, I'm not, I'm not one get, to get stuck. You yeah, know, don't get stuck. Around and just, <laughs> You know, exactly, gonna, exactly. The way you walk is forward. Yeah, yeah. para frente que se anda. Yeah, I so, love that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you know, it's been wonderful once yes, again. Yes, exactly. Thank you for, you know, for inviting me to make music. My I pleasure. feel really, you know, glad and honored as well, you know, to, oh, to you know, to perform, you do, okay. to play, to collaborate. Then breath. Okay, man. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Okay, you can finish now the talk. You yeah, want we'll okay. Just do that, yeah. Okay, where should we get back then? To oh, just I think it's, yeah. You can take. Uh, thank you her yeah, for the. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs>
again, like, yeah. thank you for... Well, it's been wonderful to have <laughs> you here. <laughs> yes, <right>? exactly. <laughs> yeah, I'm very... Well, I mean, you uh, can say, sorry to interrupt. No, you can say. <laughs> no, uh, it was awesome, you know, like, I feel really uh, glad and very uh, honored, you know, to, you know, be invited by you to perform and even to collaborate. You know, I feel oh, really, much. like... Uh, I'm so yeah. glad that you accept it. Yeah, of course. <laughs> I was like, oh, maybe she won't. Yeah. Come on. No, no, no. Not at all. Not yeah. at all. Yeah. Well, it's been, you know. Amazing. Joyful. Yes, yeah. exactly. Really nice And I'll time. see you again. Yeah, I, I hope so, so too. Yeah. All right. <laughs> okay, bye. Bye-bye. Hey, though.